My cameraman's doing okay, Duba. Not too shabby. Should I keep him? He might need a raise. I won't mock Salita. I won't record, promise. I won't record your face. Have you enjoyed this trip? I'm enjoying it. What was the best part of this trip for you? I'm going somewhere deep. Go in and go. I didn't tell him I was gonna say anything, so I only mock Salita. Hey Sibs, so I think I'm gonna start the beginning of the vlog right here. It is my first time ever in Bali. My birthday is tomorrow. This is technically day three of a trip. For context, huh? first three days were in a place called Sideman. Thank you and shout out to Wapa Di Uma Sideman Hotel Resort for the complimentary free massage, one hour massage and gorgeous flower, what's it called? Flower bath, thank you. So, um, I haven't actually had the flower bath yet. Technically, when I'm recording this, but I'm about to have it tomorrow on my actual birthday, tomorrow morning. So, Bali's huge. So there's lots of different options. In this vlog, I made sure that I want to see, above all things, Penida Island. Okay, not going to First time to be cameraman, eh? Ni siya sanay. There was, because I'm the kind of person when I'm looking at a place I want to see, I completely stalk Instagram. I look at Instagram and I find out what are the biggest hashtags. For Bali, and when it comes to Penida Island, everyone loves to see Gilingking Beach, which we went to, and Broken Beach, which was the first one we saw today. Now we're in Crystal Bay, and ganda talaga siya. Anyways, sit down tayo, ah. Eh? My cameraman's doing okay, diba? Not too shabby. Should I keep him? He might need a raise. This guy. I won't mock Salita. I won't record, promise. I won't record your face. Have you enjoyed this trip? I'm enjoying it. What was the best part of this trip for you? I'm going somewhere deep. Go in and go. I didn't tell them I was gonna say anything, so I only maxalita. Because I know Costilla, and they're going to say, "So Sebastian, who are you with? Did you go by yourself? What friends did you bring along?" And I'm just gonna make dead ma mostly. But I don't lie. The thing is, I don't lie to my YouTube audience. So most of the time, instead of lying to you, I just tell you, "Oh, I'm not gonna talk about that," which may sound like not the friendliest of times, but it's a lot better than lying to you, Dubai. Given the options, I see you. I don't need to magsalita. Wag na lo. Siya pa na kaya yata. Bakit hiya? I'm I'm not used to it. That's actually for me the best time to vlog somebody when they don't know they're being watched. I have a record of surprising people when they least expect it. Like the e-bloggers ball when I pulled the prank on just about everybody who attended. By the way, I'd like to introduce you to Arnie. He was the person I pranked before you. Because he pranked me. Oh. Hello. 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 I have a record. A record that precedes me. So I think um, for me, since I don't need to speak, he probably thinks he's going to speak. My favorite part of this trip so far was the last place we just came from, which was Gilingking Beach. I told myself I wasn't really going to take too many vlogs out here because it's just... I want to enjoy more than vlog every second. But right now I'm standing in Gilingking Beach, which is also called T-Rex because of this shape of this particular formation, this particular rock formation. And it is just so, so beautiful. <laughs> If you look at it, that's the T-Rex shape that they talk about. There's a long line of people over here, but just a little hint for people that are coming. If you pay 5,000 IDR, half of a dollar, 50 cents, uh, then you'll get access to this little tiny wood shift. And the view is particularly beautiful. Sulit na sulit talaga to. I don't know what it is, but I've seen it in photos, and this is not editing. Something about this particular area, maybe it's the rock underneath, maybe it's the sand. 
the part that just hits closest to the shore just has this gorgeous light blue tint. It's just so beautiful and that's a place I can come back to. I told earlier Kai Mr. Mr. Aya Magsalita na you have to really love a place to be able to want to visit it twice because there are so many other places in the world that one still wants to see. So context! Again, it's day three of my trip in Bali. After this, I'm gonna be heading to a hotel resort in Ubud. Tama ba? Ayaw nito. What if, what if I ask a simple question? Yung tipong na... Of the three places we've been to, between Kiling King, this one Crystal Bay, and Broken Beach, which one's your favorite? Kiling King, of course. Hmm? Kiling King, of course. Kiling King din daw. Bakit? Well, that question ends in portion. In 500 words or less. In prose. In Spanish. With the last 200 words in French. Oh, sige, bakit Kiling King Beach? Wait lang, bakit kasi mo dito sa vlog na to? Huwag nga, ikaw na lang. Baka camera siya ito. All I'll say is, thank you for coming with me. Thanks for sharing this day, especially since tomorrow is my birthday. Dami kong iniisip. Koto na yung hugot sa vlogs ko, no? Parang koto na for 2018. Look forward to 2019 hugot with Sebastian Castro. So what's your hugot for, for this trip? Wow, ayaw, mag, ayaw siya mag, magsagot, pero pwede naman siya pala magtanong. Uh, what's my hugot for this trip? Ay, alam mo na yun eh, yung first hour of our trip before we even left the airport. Okay, story time! So, I managed to lose three things in one day, but I, we found two of them. One of them is still waiting for me in the airport. The most embarrassing of those is definitely the fact that I left my luggage. I have two small carry-ons and one of them, after I passed the x-ray, we were late and somebody asked me for a picture and I knew that I had to run to the gate because they weren't gonna wait for both of us so maybe if they saw me they might give me a chance I thought in the back of my mind so I ran, I ran like Buzz Lightyear to the rescue and I made it to the gate in time. While I was thinking like, wow, we made it and everything is with us and like, we, we did such a good job, the worst is behind us. Just as I get there, lo and behold, I left my second luggage. And my second luggage was like my main luggage. This is my Urban Chet. By the way, shout out to Urban Chet. This is not sponsored by them. They happen to be a cute gay couple that makes bags and they make leather stuff. I have at least three pairs of shoes by them that I wear all the time. I love them. But I happened to bring this backpack, but not bring the biggest luggage that I should have brought. My bigger carry-on. So, anyways, I'm gonna end the vlog here. This was more of like a sit-down vlog because I'm in Bali and I don't want to vlog every second of it. So, ito na lang yung magiging go goodbye. I had a good trip. My closing remarks po. Mr. Ayo Magsalita. Sige. Thank you for joining me on this trip. That's enough for me. Until next vlog. Alright, and before I forget, ha, huh? so everything you just watched just now, that was from like two months ago, December. Right now I'm recording this on February. I feel like I'll give you guys a little bit of an explanation because I I left YouTube again for the second time. Sorry. And um I don't just leave just to leave half, but I left YouTube for a reason. I happen to have met somebody. And it's the reason, same reason I left last time. I guess a part of me just kind of finds it easier to do this whole weird dating process when it's, when it's just quieter. And um, that's why. So I left YouTube actually for two reasons. The first one was I met somebody. And the second reason was because I was starting my first ever food business. <laughs> this is my first ever, it's an original food concept. It's called Titos Boritos. Meaning I did not buy a franchise for someone else's business. I actually went through the trouble of taking a family recipe, of finding packaging for it, of finding suppliers for the ingredients, of going through all the mess of business permits and licenses, and hiring an accountant and my first ever employee 
and I just felt like I've been promoting brands that aren't my own for so long. Why not just promote a brand that is my own? So that's where that idea came from and um, I'm really happy to share it with you guys finally. One thing that I've been working on for a long time, it's launching of all days on Valentine's Day, February 14th, the address is on the screen. It is basically in the heart of the University Belt, one minute walk from the LRT station. Um, and because it's Valentine's Day, at yung Valentine's Day, hindi, hindi lang siya para sa mga may joa, di ba? Tapos, kasi mga single, my silver linings. So that's why I decided to throw a singles promo. Sa lahat ng mga singles ha, 10% off kung single ka na, 20% off kung heartbroken ka pa. I didn't wanna go cheap on you guys. A lot of people immediately ask me, eh, eh, paano malalaman kung single siya o hindi? Eh, syempre, <laughs> wala naman fact proof, walang lie detector, ha? Bigyan mo ako story, totoo, hindi. Tapos, ayun, you're eligible for a discount. And of course, I haven't had a proper, like, YouTube hangout session with people who watch the vlog. I haven't had that for the longest time. Sorry, I can't hold this properly. Shout out kay Kuya. Hello po. Hello sir. So anyways, long story short, I will see you guys on February 14th, the day is set, and I just came in to pop and say that because I'm excited to see you guys. It's my first ever food business. Of course, I'd love and appreciate you guys bothering to support it. But yes, I promise I'm gonna be there on February 14th, and I will hang out the entire day for as long as you guys want, and I will be answering your questions. I don't want to ano mga love life questions, ha? Just, you know, I am... I'm in a good place and I'm happy I left for as long as I did. I know maybe not every one of you is happy, but sometimes it's good to take a social media break. And um, you'll meet him soon enough. Yeah, I'll say. Yeah. Bye!